So early this morning, uh, we received notification of a weather briefing by the National Weather Service at 10 a.m. Uh, the weather forecast has changed, and now the National Weather Service is calling for a moderate risk of severe storms for eastern Kentucky, including Pike County, uh, with a chance of hail up to an inch and a half in diameter, uh, wind gusts over 80 miles an hour, which is essentially hurricane force winds, and also risk of isolated tornadoes. The National Weather Service has stated that this weather event is highly uncommon for this season. If we have winds that uh, are 80 miles an hour as forecast, we expect a lot of trees down, a lot of power lines and other utilities to be impacted. If there's a line down, please assume it's energized. Don't touch it. Uh, don't try to drive through water. If you can't see the road, turn around. Are you ready for a new school year? What better way to start a new school year off right than with a new device on the network that keeps our students and teachers connected? Appalachian Wireless. Whether you need a new smartphone, wearable, or an iPad, we have your back-to-school solution. Visit AppalachianWireless.com or go into one of our 26 retail locations for our back-to-school deals that'll help you show up and show out this school year. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. Officials urge residents to remain cautious and vigilant during the watch period. In case of any road emergencies, such as blockages or hazardous situations, individuals are encouraged to report them by calling 606-432-6230. The emergency alert system has been ag activated, which is something we typically don't see very often. Uh, there is a thunderstorm watch in place uh, for the remainder of the afternoon and a, uh, also a tornado watch until 6 p.m. Uh, they're saying that most of the bad weather should be out of here by around 4 o'clock. However, the tornado watch is going to be until 6 p.m. Residents are advised to stay indoors during the watch period and avoid unnecessary travel until the weather situation stabilizes. Get everything that you can put up secured in case we do have the winds and, and be prepared because we don't know exactly what uh, form this storm is going to take in terms of how, how strong the winds are going to be. Uh, the risk of hail is there. Uh, the risk of flash flooding is there and also the risk of tornadoes. Reporting from Mountaintop News, I'm Ethan Miller.